And welcome back. We have Dr. Elena Stevens, Associate Professor at Bethany Lutheran College and Mental Health Counselor. Thank you and for having me. Yes, you're here to talk about body language, body language. and like what it is, why yeah. it's important, how to. And what what does this mean? How to know? Like I don't know what it. What does that? We're gonna mean? find out. Today. We're gonna find out today. <laughs> It's the, so it's the language we don't speak, mm. and yet there are so many ways in which we speak it. And I think what's important to think about is how do I know what is this? Yeah. yeah. I don't, this means something, this means something, yeah. this means sure. something. The, it's the, again, the unspoken language that can sometimes tell you more than what the spoken language is. Like they say, a picture is worth a thousand words, a body language is worth just as many thousand words. And it's our hands, it's our eyes, it's our body posture, it's our smile, it's not just one part of our body, it's, it's our touch, mm -hmm. it's our posture, it's your mm -hmm. whole body mm -hmm. and sometimes we don't think about what our body is doing but if you're ever wondering what is this person thinking about what I have to say um, mm -hmm. are they engaged mm -hmm. with what mm -hmm. I'm doing when you're out with friends or you're on a date and you're wondering are we vibing are we jiving with yeah. each other the body is one way to kind of answer those questions so I'm looking at your body right now you're very much engaged with me your head is tilted to the side mm -hmm. your eyes are open you're beautiful too. your <laughs> eyes are open <laughs> wide your posture tells me you're listening to me you're engaged should you be standing like this kind of looking away I think we can immediately tell mm -hmm. we're probably not as engaged mm -hmm. so um, the other part of this is not just what is what is their body saying what is my body mm -hmm. saying um, and that can be equally as important when you are engaged in some kind of conversation so I'm gonna pick on you Nick let's yeah. say we're on a date with each yeah, other and yeah. you're like is this am I vibing is, is what I'm saying um, is she connecting with mm -hmm. me so I'm looking looking at you, my yeah. eyes, my eyebrows, this is the flirtatious okay. eyebrow, they're up a little okay. bit. My head is tilted to the side, yeah. I've got a, like an engaging smile, yeah. a warm open body posture. Yeah. I might even lean in, and this is, again, physical there's, is, there's, is, yeah, is the yeah. nonverbal too. Mm -hmm. If I lean in, if I'm mm -hmm. here, I'm into it. I'm yeah, totally into it. For sure. Now let's sure. say we're sitting at a table and you're going on, you're doing one of these things and mm -hmm. I don't know what you're doing and mm -hmm. I'm just kind of Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. See, my mouth is different. Uh -huh. My shoulders just closed off to you, and mm -hmm. maybe I'm looking away more than I'm looking at you. I'm probably not vibing with what is going on. Yeah, so how can you, you know, when you're in those situations, like, mm -hmm. I feel like, you know, on the one hand, there is, um, you know, there's, like, stuff that, like, this equals this, like, more more often than not. But I feel like, mm -hmm. to a certain extent, it, it can be, you know, very intuitive for, for some people to, to understand that, you know? Mm -hmm. So how... How can somebody begin to acknowledge that, you know, body language does exist and mm -hmm. like how can one begin to interpret that? Sure. Um, we engage with people in every aspect of our lives mm -hmm. and kind of slowing down and checking in. Mm -hmm. It's uh, myself included sometimes when we're just like really like in the moment, we're actually out of the moment yeah. and our mind is somewhere else yeah. and we're um, and we're technology driven. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. Kids that I work with these days, I can't even get them to make eye contact mm -hmm. with me right. so we're like we're kind of um, robbed of the opportunity mm -hmm. to non-verbally yeah. engage mm -hmm. so it's it's slowing down kind of paying attention to the moment looking at eyes looking at eyebrows mm -hmm. looking at hands and these are things that sometimes make us uncomfortable mm -hmm. uh, it's a very vulnerable thing mm -hmm. to pay attention to For a non-verbal sure. so I think sure. that's what's important and like the way you're looking at me now like yeah. you're hearing me you're interested yeah. don't change what you're doing you're, you're like you're the way your eyebrows come in I can tell you're listening to mm -hmm. what I am saying, mm -hmm. which you're supposed to, because we're on air with you. Yeah, yeah, right? oh, yeah, yeah. I'm doing the job. <laughs> we are doing the job. Yeah. I feel like we could talk about this all day. We but really can. We have to go. Um, so thank you thank so much you for being so here much. today. Yeah, thank you for having me. And we'll have more when we come back on Cato Living.